The painting titled Ophelia is an oil paint on canvas with its dimensions being 762 by 1118 millimeters. It can be found at the world-renowned Tate Art Museum located in Great Britain. Act 4, Scene 7. There on the pendant bows her coronet weeds, clamoring to hang an envious silver broke. When down her weedy trophies and herself fell in the weeping brook, her clothes spread wide and mermaid-like, a while they bore her up. But long it could not be to let her garments, heavy with their drink, pulled the poor wretch from her melodious sleigh to muddy death. Ophelia is the daughter of Polonius and the love interest of the play's main character, Hamlet. Her loyalty to her father and brother, along with her intense love for Hamlet, lead to ultimate tragedy for her in the end, her lover murdering her father. The death of her father drives Ophelia to insanity, which leads to her committing suicide by drowning herself. Ophelia's character portrays purity, innocence, femininity, and submissiveness qualities which were the mold of the perfect or ideal woman of the time. The painting was constructed by English painter Sir John Everett Malias from 1851 to 1852. Malias was recognized as being the main founder of the pre-Raphaelite artist movement. This movement focused on breaking away from traditional Renaissance and classical art to focus on spiritualism, artistic freedom, and connection to nature. Malias, along with other pre-Raphaelite painters, William Holman Hunt and Dante Gabriel Rossetti, almost had an obsession with Shakespeare's works and often painted several scenes from his plays. During the mid-19th century, women began to assemble, forming the women's suffrage movement. No longer would women continue to be demeaned by men. Women fought for the right to vote and to ultimately be seen as a man's equal. Women fought for the right to come into their own and no longer to be categorized as a pure woman or, on the other extreme, an improper woman. Here's a picture of the women's suffrage movement in America. Here in this analysis map, one can see that there are many things going on in the painting from the symmetrical balance in the top right hand corner, the inorganic lines and shapes, the negative space, and the achromatic and neutral color scheme. Upon closer look, one can not only see that she is holding flowers in her right hand, but that they are also scattered further down her dress and further along to the left side. There are two very important flowers to take note of in the painting poppies and the daisies. The poppies signalizing death, the death of her father and now the death of herself as she was driven mad by her lover, and daisies, an innocence that women were expected to maintain during this era. Ophelia represents the theme of gender and madness, the portrayal of women since the beginning of time in history. It sparked a movement of women becoming independent, strong, true and non-reliant on men.